And it's probably too late to leave. Yeah, I should have just raised these cities. Why did I take them? I should have just raised them to the ground. Oh, crap. Is it too late to build happiness buildings? Son of a bitch. <sighs> well, hopefully they're not too bad in combat. Why are you there? You're just gonna get moved. Alright, let's save and go to war. Fuck it. Let's see what happens. Uh, hello, Askia. Let's find out exactly how bad our demoralized units are. Set up. And bombard. Wow, 33% penalty due to being very unhappy. Ugh. And the unhappiness is only going to get worse when I actually take over these cities. Oh, this place got a, this guy got a promotion. Good. Let's finish these guys off. They're gonna be easy pickings. I just I I really am gonna need to have a uh, peace treaty out as soon as the war is over. I can actually come around this way, can I? Let's go see what's over there. A safe attack, but definitely not a great attack. Stay there, and you just get close enough to make sure you can attack the city. We can take over the settlers. Sure, why not? Turns them to workers, I think. Guns against guns. But I have better guns, although I do have a fling morale penalty. Even with the great general. God. Wow, damn this unhappiness. Jesus. I don't think this game is meant for these big empires. Especially not without the puppet states, that's for sure. It's weird that my riflemen lose their ability to bombard, but... I guess what they're doing, it's like they're sort of zooming out the battlefield. You know, when archers ruled the field, they, they did have incredible range. Now, the gun fighting... Wow, we actually lost that unit? Okay, this is going really poorly. But now the gunfighting is basically the equivalent of melee, and it's just this artillery, which is so much further away than archery that has taken over that theme. So, I mean, thematically it makes sense, but realistically, if the archers could fire two tiles, these artillery should be able to hit from, you know, back here or something. Atlanta wants gems. Lost the worker, lost the cavalry. That is really, really bad. Oh, they have a cavalry in the city. That's part of the reason it's being so much of a pain in the ass. Still, we may be able to take it here. Not quite. God! Alright, well, next game I'm definitely going to play it quite differently. a hill? Yeah. Alright, then you are going to get drill, and you're going to move up into the hill, uh, which means you'll get bombarded by s the city. That's no good, actually. And cannons. Ugh. You just sit tight. Man, if we lose this at this point, ugh. Ugh. Frankly, I want to lose some cities. Like, I don't mind 
Come on over and kill some of my cities. We don't want this many of them. I shouldn't have taken them at all. I actually have enough money to upgrade the trebuchet to a cannon. Hmm, interesting. I wonder if I want to upgrade anything else instead. Hmm. If I had more money, I'd be able to upgrade these guys to infantry. Alright, Trebuchet, looks like you're getting the upgrade. Congratulations. Oh! I fulfilled Sidon's request to hurt Askia, and now they're my allies. Okay, now this is awesome. Very, very, very helpful. Um, I still got the problem. I don't have gems anywhere. That's apparently like the one missing resource. Does anyone have gems? It'd be interesting if we actually found a world missing a resource. Am I still critically unhappy? Yeah. Although my unhappiness has improved. Somehow. I don't know why, but it did. There should be a button to search for a resource. Not the first time I've been looking around on the map. Copenhagen has gems. Hmm. Hmm. But we don't have any money to bribe them. They're friends. We need 250. That would get them to allied. And that would be pretty good. I suppose we could just send some troops there, too. <laughs> oh, but then we'd have another city, and that would be awful. No, we don't want that. I should have just not upgraded my unit. Ah, oh, if I'd thought of this beforehand... That would have helped, because I bet you 20 is the cutoff for the uh, combat penalty. And it'd be really, really helpful if we could lose that penalty. Oh, we're just being attacked all over. And we lost a rifleman. Oh, man. And my great general. And another rifleman. Oh, fuck. And a cavalry. Oh, this is awful. Oh, this is awful. Oh, tears our ally. We must have done something. Whoa, so much spam. Must be, it all related to us having a war with Askia. City Washington can bomb someone. Bombard barbarians, ancient ruins. Yeah, good. Well, having extra allies is going to help, but... <laughs> We're still in bad fucking shape. Raise the city. We don't want it. We want to get rid of the city. Oh, we're at minus 32 now. Oh, it's so bad. No. Oh, we can bombard these guys thanks to our incredible range. Wow, and kill them. Go, go, artillery. You may be my one saving grace in this. Oh, God. It's going so badly. Um, okay, let's move away from Seattle so you can't bombard me anymore. So, uh, are you willing to discuss peace? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to do with our game. No. Oh my god. What am I doing here next to San Francisco? Like, back, back up. <sighs> Let's move towards Washington.
No, I still don't have peace with these guys. Okay. Or open borders, rather. Come on, Germany. Be a pal. I don't... I don't have much money. Oh, no, I can't do this. I need happiness from something first. I need I need to save my money so I can bribe, bribe Copen, Copenhagen so I can get their gems and alleviate my crippling unhappiness. All right, let's just pull back. Oh. What are you doing there? Uh, open terrain bonus. This is so bad. Oh, man. Well, now you know, folks. Like, when you're playing this, watch your happiness. Don't take too many cities. Like, how many units does he have that he's able to do this war here at the same time? I shouldn't have tried to take this entire continent in one push. I'm happy I didn't declare war with Germany yet, because then I would be completely screwed. Wow, tier defense is 37. That's actually really impressive. Hmm. Oh, he's got walls. Okay, yeah, it's time to pull away from Timbuktu. Although we can't. Well, maybe we can hide in this corner here. <laughs> Which actually requires an embark to get to. So funny. Yeah, we're gonna pull back with our artillery. People want whales. Washington can attack someone. Yeah, please do. You just fortify here, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if I can do an amphibious attack. It'll probably give me a big penalty or something. Why can't I... Can oh, no. Keep fucking burning to death. Seriously. Just go away. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, my anti-tank gun has finally arrived. And he does have incredible, incredible attacking power. Oh, wow, Germany's got a lot of troops. <laughs> Tier, I think, will eventually fall here. Which is too bad, because if I waited a little longer, they'd actually give me a unit, which would be really nice. I lost a cavalry... Yeah, we don't have enough troops to keep this going. Oh, and we don't have enough happiness to build up units. 